Hi, I'm Dr. Vonda Damodovan from Pediatric Infectious Disease. A lot of parents and families wonder how contagious HPV is um, and if their children can get JRRP um, easily from other people and also have questions about how to prevent it. Children cannot catch JRRP or HPV by playing with each other or by sharing utensils. Siblings cannot be infected through regular household contact. There's currently only one vaccine available in the U.S. to prevent HPV, the virus that causes JRRP. Gardasil 9 is a vaccine that provides protection against the four HPV types that included in the first Gardasil, 6, 11, 16, and 18, as well as five additional types, 31, 33, 45, 52, and 58. Type 6 and 11 are most associated with genital warts, as well as JRRP, and the others, especially 16 and 18, are associated with cervical cancer. Cervarix, which is a bivalent vaccine containing only types 16 and 18, is no longer available in the U.S. and would not have provided any protection against the HPV types causing JRRP. Gardasil 9 is now approved for people 9 to 26 years of age, is very safe, is typically well tolerated, and causes a very strong immune response, providing long-term protection against HPV. The current recommendations for both boys and girls to receive two doses of the vaccine at least six months apart, starting at age 11. Adolescents and young adults 15 and older need to receive the previous standard of three required doses. Infants and young children cannot be protected directly with the vaccine, but may be protected if their mothers were vaccinated as children or young adults prior to HPV infection. Firstborn children are at greater risk of developing JRRP during delivery, but there is no way to predict the individual risk for a subsequent child as the level or presence of HPV will vary over time. Women should receive all recommended care to make sure that there are no active HPV infections that would raise the risk of transmission to a baby during delivery. They should also discuss with their obstetricians regarding their personal risk factors that might make a cesarean delivery necessary. Catch-up vaccination is currently recommended for women up to age 26 and for most men up to age 21, in some cases 26, who did not receive the full HPV series as adolescents. However, the FDA recently approved HPV-9, or Gardasil-9, to be given to adults up to age 45 as they might still receive protection from virus types they have not already been exposed to, but may be in the future. The official CDC recommendation from the Advisory Committee on Immunization Practices has not yet changed, but may do so in the near future. As there are many types of HPV, even if a child has JRRP and is type 11, for example, receiving the vaccine would still provide protection in the future against the eight other types that are included. If you have any questions about HPV or JRP and its infectious cause, feel free to talk to your pediatrician who can always reach out to us in Pediatric Infectious Disease for further consultation. Thank you.